Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is the 34th tutorial in this course and in this tutorial we're going to see how we can create a navigation bar using CSS and HTML. So for this tutorial I've created uh, a file called navigation.html and in this file you can see that within the style section I have applied a bunch of rules to unordered lists, list elements as well as uh, the anchor element. So first let's check out the rules that we've applied to the UL element. I have changed the background color to orange and the position is fixed. I have a margin of 350 pixels from the left and then the list style type is none. You know, we are just keeping things simple. For the li element or the list item element, I have changed the font size to 20 points. The width is 60 pixels so that, you know, each element within the navigation bar has, uh, you know, a uniform width. And then the padding is 10 pixels. We want to see some gap between uh, the different list items and uh, the display is in line. So, you know, they're not going to be displayed vertically. They're going to be displayed on a single line uh, horizontally. And uh, for the anchor uh, element, I have uh, applied uh, the color property. I've changed the color to black. I mean, that is the default color. Uh, you could change the color if you want to. And then uh, the width is 60 pixels, right? So within the body section, uh, I have uh, an unordered list and uh, you know, these are the four uh, uh, links or uh, tabs that you would see in most websites, home, about us, services we offer and uh, contact us and that's why I have these as my list items. And uh, you know, when you would click on any of these, you would be redirected to google.com, right? So that's why I have used the anchor uh, element here and uh, I've used the href attribute, I've given it the value http colon www.google.com so when you would see this page in your browser this is how it would look so you know I have a home about us services we offer and contact us and you know this is quite dull and uh, you know since I do not have anything else on the website it's looking quite odd and you know the background is orange whereas the rest of the page is white so you know that's making it look even more odd but this was just to give you an idea that this is how you can create uh, na navigation bars uh, for your website if you're using a template then you would probably have uh, the navigation bar built for you uh, already but you know you should know that you can tweak it if you know CSS then you can change the properties you could change uh, where they redirect to uh, or you know if you want to see a different font style for your navigation bar or a different font size then you can uh, use CSS and you can get those effects so if you would click on any of these if I would click on home I would be redirected to google.com let me get back to my page if I would click on about us I would again be redirected to google so this is uh, how you can create a navigation bar and I hope you guys had fun watching this video. You may subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and thanks for watching this one. I'll see you in the next tutorial. Till then, take care.